Hey everyone, welcome to another amazing vlog. The last time I said this was almost 1.5 years ago. But before starting today's vlog, I have a simple question for you. What is it that takes to make a great college festival? Is it dance and music? Or is it the enthusiasm of the youth? Or maybe even a super bike in that case. Or maybe all of the above mentioned. Well, good morning boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. It's a colorful day indeed and I am here at uh, TechFest 2022 which is the annual science and technology festival of uh, IIT Bombay. Well, this is the 26th edition of the fest. Uh, the first time the fest happened was way back in 1996. It includes a wide range of events uh, ranging from workshops, exhibitions, international robo wars, EDM concerts, pro nights and so on and so forth. But what makes this edition of TechFest stand out is the fact that it is happening in offline mode after three years. And this time around they have witnessed a participation from over uh, 500 international colleges and uh, 2500 national colleges. So you can just imagine how big kind of an event this is. In addition to that they have partnered with Geo making IIT Bombay campus the first ever 5G Fire Institute in India. Also there are going to be sessions conducted by public figures ranging from politics, technology, education, film and even content creation. And I feel nothing but proud privilege to be associated with something like this. Unfortunately I could not make it to the day one and two of the fest uh, because of some personal reasons. But I'm super excited to see what day three has to offer. Sunday morning and people are already walking in as you guys can see so that just shows the level of uh, fan base and the dedication that people have towards this fest in general. So right now it's going to be a face off between me and Nejaj Bhai. Let's see who wins it. What is the game? This is the game. What is this? Lens or me? Yeah. It's a lot of power and you have pushed it. Sorry, it's a lot of power. I don't know. So right now we are heading forward to watch one of the key attractions of TechFest that is a BrahMos missile and we are also going to have a quadrupad robot. So this is the main uh, IIT building. I am just in love with the entire campus, the chirping of the birds, the cool breezy air, the extrinsic wind. This is something that we highly like in a city like Mumbai and this campus just fulfills all of them. If you are somebody like me who loves to spend time with the nature, this is the best place to be. So 
we are in this exhibition called Techno Connect, which is an exhibition by the students, and I see a lot of exciting displays around. So let me just show you guys the same. So we are a team of 80 students. Hmm. We design and manage the whole car in the institute itself. The like maximum speed of our car is 140 km per hour, and it goes from like 0 to 100. This is stand for self driving cars. The camera, the cars, I'm here in GPS on the top. The camera, the capture, the surround. This all data is fed to the computer. Also, we have a final destination. Then, those final destinations are done. This steer can control the left side. We can see motion planning. Got it. So, self driving cars, which was once a myth, is becoming a reality. It's at its baby stage, so I'm excited to see how this journey progresses. The spherical robots, major mass has been concentrated below its CG, making the inner model happen to stay stationary. And as you can see, the outer hull is connected to these two some motors, making the hull to rotate. And because of the self-stabilizing principle, the inner model happens to stay stationary. This was the first version which we developed. And when we went to Energy Commandos in Mumbai, mm. they suggested it's not possible to take such a big robot and missions and all. So considering all those feedback from them, we actually came up with this version of smaller version. Yeah, we came up with a fisheye camera which gives you a 360 dome view. So this robot has been controlled using an Android application which we have made. Well, coming to the use case of the robot, so just take a scenario as a Taj attack. Type scenarios and all, condos and army personnel can actually throw this robot inside the room. Mm. Can actually get the live video feed into your system and can get to know what is the scenario, the terrorist other and all. So that's how it is like. So when they throw it, won't it break? <laughs> At this moment, yes, this is just a lab prototype. Yeah. At the end of December, we would be getting much robust version. Hmm. And Sounds that good. can be definitely, we can throw and... It won't break. Yeah. yeah it won't. So good stuff, all the best. Thank you. So I'm just going to give it one more try if I can get all the five designs in the sequence. You see. So there is an enmity of me between I. If this would have existed for the online lectures, I would have scored better, understood better. This is what makes TechFest stand out when compared to the rest of the college festivals. It's not just about dance, music or EDM concerts, but rather it's about technology, innovation and progress. the convocation hall where we have a session by physics wala Alak Pandey. Well he's considered to be one of the biggest revolutions in the Indian edtech system. Well I don't know much about him because uh, the end of 10th also marked the end of physics in my life. But uh, I have Neeraj with me who is going to say something about physics wala. बहुत बढ़िया टीचर है हम अपने फिजिक्स से पढ़ाई फर्स्ट ईयर इंजीनियरिंग और लेवेंथ ट्वेल्थ के उन्हीं से किए हैं उन्हें कितने तब सब सीखे और अभी उनकी वैसे भी सही तो वो भी चलते देखने वाले हैं उसके पहले उनको साथ साथ उनकी लाइव देते हैं Be blessed. Be blessed that you have your worst moment in life. If you are presently, अगर अभी आपके life का सबसे खराब समय चल रहा है, तो blessings हैं आपके ऊपर कि आप इतना नीचे गए हो. Because I believe कि जो भी अपनी हार में जितना नीचे गया है ना, वो अपनी जीत में उतना ऊपर चला जाता है. For example, मेरे सामने कोई भी बैठा है, बोलता है कि अगर किसी दिन मान लो कुछ हो गया, फिर दिस वाला नीचे चला, तो क्या करो I know how to start it from zero. उससे बुरा तो नहीं हो सकता लाइफ में। तो be blessed that you have a first time. अरे तुम एक कलक पांडे लेकर जाओगे, हम एक में दस हजार कलक पांडे खड़ा करके दिखाएंगे। So 
Alak Pandey sir's session just got over. I have great respect for that man. His story from rags to riches, nothing but inspiration. The sun is set and the party is just about to begin. We're going to be having three performances, including that of Maddox, followed by a drone light show. Well, that is going to be a one of a kind event, and you must witness this. In the meantime, I see thousands of excited people around. Texas 2022, are you doing? When I say tech, you say fast. Tech, fast, tech, fast. So it was definitely worth the wait. What a show, man. Which can I buy? Buy pot, buy the key, buy. American. This is what makes Techfest what it is. Honestly, I wasn't expecting a lot of people to be there because uh, today we also had the finals of uh, FIFA World Cup happening, but the crowd was just insane. No words, I mean. So with that, we come to the end of uh, the 26th edition of Techfest. It was such a colorful experience. Thank you, Techfest IIT team, for uh, enabling this opportunity and making me a part of this. Thank you so very much. So that is pretty much it for this particular vlog. Thank you so very much for watching it till the end. It feels great to switch back to vlogging after a really long time. A big thanks to Pavitra, Nivesh and Shri Pradeep from the media team of Techfest for enabling this opportunity. Now speaking of Techfest, as I always say, with every passing year, the event just keeps getting bigger and better. The only concern I had was with the security of the fest. Now here I'm not referring to the police officers or the security guard who were on duty. They did a great job, of course. Now here I'm specifically referring to the student volunteer security department of Techfest. I somewhat felt that it wasn't quite enough to manage over 2 lakh people. There were attempts of stampede at some places and the crowd even went out of control. So the concept of organizing a free and an open for all event is all great, but security should be given primary importance, not just to maintain the reputation of the fest, but also to make sure that every single person who comes to attend the fest go back home with happy memories but all in all the event was awesome it was a great attempt to bring back the fest in offline mode after a span of 3 years and uh, they did succeed in doing so kudos to the entire team of techfest for this great success now since events are back to normal i'm looking forward to more of these with that being said it's me jinto signing out i will see you in the next video until then goodbye